Hello, and welcome to Dr. B Plays Rekinda. I am Dr. Bye Bye. And this is an awesome game I found on the BG Person website. Let's play. It squeaks. That's amazing. Alright. I gotta do this shit. I adjusted my microphone finally. And I'm wearing headphones. So it records everything. I'm hoping it'll be a lot clearer. I also have to adjust the volume every now and then because I'm afraid it drowns me out. I'm not sure on how to fix that, but, uh, I'll figure it out somehow, I'm probably. Once upon a time, there was a sorrowful princess locked away in a mansion. A traveling prince appeared, and he took the princess away from her prison. Then, he said, you shall suffer no more in sorrow. Do not despair for this world, do not fear, for I shall be with you. Then they both died in a fire. <laughs> no, but such is how the prince saved the princess from the world of darkness, and they lived happily ever after. An ordinary story we've all heard. I've never heard it. A fairy tale from time immemorial. When the hell was that? Dot. However, not in stories, but in real life, is this such a common occurrence? No, it, it isn't. It never happens. Not to me. I want a princess. Or a prince? Or both? Like a two-headed prince prince? No, that's just monstrous. Never mind. Papa? When will Mama get better? She's not sick, so... Very soon. B you always say that, Papa. How do I know you're not lying again? Hmm... Nom nom nom. Perhaps by the time you've read this story... Papa! Son! S son! Suke! Who is that? Where am I? And who am I? Where is this? This is Dandelion Hill. All kinds of flowers grow here, but dandelions especially. Huh? <laughs> I don't get it. He's a strange kid. Huh? Who is? That boy by the riverside. He hugs this book and stares into the river. And he lets his tears fall. It's definitely weird. You betch, help him out. He's clearly sad. Go cheer him up. Yeah, he is crying. Okay, let's just let him cry. Not even try. We're assholes, apparently. Somebody? Huh? Somebody? Take me away from here. Dot. Um. Time bomb set. What the fuck? Huh? Five, four, three. Uh, um, two, one. See, this is what happens when you're not nice to people. They blow you the fuck up. Whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> what? Looks like somebody's finally awake. What? What was? A time bomb alarm clock. If you're not on time, boom. What the fuck, Mom? Of course, it doesn't really explode. It just makes a loud explosion noise. Countdowns always bring on the presser. What a great purchase this was. Since you're so lousy to wake up, I went down to Don Quijote and got it for 2,980 yen. That's only like 30 bucks in American. That's kind of expensive, but I can't argue with the results. It's okay, I'll pay it back. Wait, what? You stole my money, you bitch. Pay it back. Huh? You'll learn when you're older. Now hurry and get breakfast. Didn't I tell you you were staying with your grandpa and grandma over the holiday? Uh, oh yeah! I'll go right away. Well, hurry. Damn it, Mom. That dream again. Just who is that boy? It is your child self. And he is crying over the ability to not be a princess. What the fuck is this? Sinsuke? Save it. Hold oh, Steph while you're moving with the arrow keys today. Holy shit, look at how fast he goes. It's like ninja speed. Like, whoopoo! Where are you? Whoopa! And look at this basket. It's a basket. A waste basket. My chest are in here torn to pieces. No one will know, right? Yeah, probably not. Night on the Galactic Railroad. Frequently asked test questions. My clothes are hung naturally, depending on your definition of natural. Every boy's. Really? Every boy's new room needs flowers? No, they need potted plants. There's a difference between potted plants and potted flowers, damn it. What's this? Cupboard with my favorite dishes? White stains. Someone needs to clean the sink. What the fuck have they been doing to our sink? It's actually Dad who loves flowers. 
weird. You know what, TV? Let me watch TV. You've never gotten on the bus alone before, have you? Make sure to greet Grandpa and Grandma. Okay. TV detective. A murderer at these hot springs. What a nefarious deed. It's an actual newscast? It's actually Chizura Azuma who solves these hot spring cases. When Dad's, when's Dad coming back from his trip? Hmm, not for a while. He sure goes on a lot of trips. What the fuck? Don't kick me out. I want to watch TV. Do you have your wallet? Don't forget tissues and your handkerchief. Oh, yeah, I'll need those tissues. I'm okay. The bus stop is west of here. I know that. Well, be off then. Bye. Bitch, you forgot my baseball bat. What if I want to mug someone? West. West. Which way is west? I don't know. Probably the west way. I'm taking my baseball bat, woman. I'm taking this television. Young ladies doing stuff in a hot... Oh, <laughs> let's watch this for an hour. <laughs> I'll only need five minutes. <laughs> okay, whatever. Uh, clock. My morning bread. I wish I could have pasta or something. Everyone loves pasta. Waste basket. Seems to be for nature materials. Natural. Whatever. Um, oh, hey, lady. With green hair. Oh, Mammy. Mammy? Oh, Sansuki. Are you going out? A high school student from the house over. We've played together since I was young, and we're still great friends. Big sis, ma she's not really my big sister, right? She kind of want to fuck her. Yeah, I'm going to my grandma and grandpa's. Huh? Alone? Wow. Why is that? Well, I'm taking the bus, and and you don't know where the bus stop is. Yeah. Okay, I'll show you there. Really? Thanks. Don't mention it. Mommy, join the party. Sweet, we're having a party. Oh yeah, mommy. Why are you in uniform on a holiday? Well, I. Uh, you wouldn't get it. Don't worry about it. You and your boyfriend doing kinky schoolgirl fantasy set. Come on, Japan. Come on. I'm assuming your boyfriend's name is Japan. I don't know why. It's just the first country that comes to mind. This isn't the way. Well, fuck you. I want to go this way. And... Dash! Damn it, woman. Let's go this way. Damn it. What are you doing? Ooh, that color. Huh? Your hair looks like festering worms. I can accept girls who dye their hair brown, but this is deplorable. I'm going to be sick. I want to punch her. Seuss! Seuss! This is not gravity fault, you stupid bitch. I'll punch her in your kidneys. And then I will punch your kidneys again on the other side. That way your other kidney will get pissed at your other kidney because your kidney thinks it's punching your other kidney. And your kidneys will have a war inside of your body, and you will die from war kidneys. It's the leading cause of death in kidney-related scenarios. What the fuck are you doing? 30 years waiting for the bus, trains, taxis, they come right away, but never buses. I just have no bus luck. No bus luck. You've been waiting for the same bus for 30 years, you stupid person, just call a cab. Man, what about you? You're a cop, right? There's a vicious dog to the west, so it's too dangerous to go walking there. Ah, well shit. Anyways, go to the west, damn it. What do you mean this isn't the way? You're kidding, right? What, is the way in my backyard? Dad, mom's room, is it in my room? You, you wanna make love? I got a nice bed, it's made for one, but you can ride on top of me. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, wait, I think I figured it out, it's this thing, right? Here we go, the bus stop. Um, okay, the bus that goes to grandma and grandpa's comes at, looks like it'll be a little while, what do you wanna do? Hmm, maybe we should go to the secret base while we're here. You have a secret base? Yeah, I'll let you come. I think it's north of here. Fight the dog. Damn it, woman. Oh, shit. We are fast. Really? There's like nothing. This street leads right to our secret base. How the fuck is that a secret? Woman, punch your face. You're ugly. And you smell. Go away. You're not shoes. How is this a secret? It has badass music, but it's not secretive at all. I mean, come on. Look, just check this music. Badassery! It's amazing. I, I really don't want to drown me out, but I really want to hear it too. Chai! Meow, meow, meow! 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 Righteous. What the fuck are you doing, dude? Akira, this is our secret base. Fancy, huh? Maybe a little disorganized. Oh yeah, make sure to read the notice here. It's useful for fighting bad guys. Anytime something happens to the base, I'll put up a notice, so read them. What the fuck is this? Laws of battle. Blocking, trucel, blocked attacks, only do a quarter of the usual damage. 
Observe the enemy and block their shit. Sap the enemy's wheel power. Some attacks are too powerful to just block. Keep them from using them in the first place. How the fuck do I do that? Enemies are unleashed to attack that warning. Try carefully. Keep your health up. If you can flick ailments better, you know special abilities. If you lose, check your surroundings for items and escape. Just run the fuck away. Your secret base is crappy, dude. What are you? Who are you? What do you want? Morning, Sensuke! You're kind of late today. Sakai, so yeah, Sarah. A girl in my class. She likes to play more than the other girls, and she's really carefree. And that's why we will fuck her. You here with Mammy? Something special? Yeah, today I'm... I'm teleport. Taking the bus, huh? Yes. What about you? Hey, Sensuke, morning. Morning. Ryu! Holy shit, do Heideken. A friend since first grade, the friendliest of my friends. I heard you wanted to hang out until your bus arrived. Well, what should we do? RJ. Da -na -na -na. And when the bus was about to arrive. Almost time, Sensuke. Oh, okay. Okay, bye, Ryu. Bye, you say, say, yeah, bye. See you again. No, you won't. I'm gonna fucking die in a haunted house. This is our Yeah, I know. You stupid lady. Whatever. How do I save it? Can I just save it from the menu screen? Items. Memory. There we go. I got mommy. She's a sofo more. And I'm a third grader. I am freaking. I am a player. I got a sophomore already. What about you? Meow, meow, meow. English mofo. So sorry. I have some advice to make up for it. Oh, but this is for the players. So don't mind me, Sensuke. In real life, you would confuse the crap out of since so whatever face. First, save costly. This is one of those games where your friends may or may not keep dying depending on your choices and actions. So use separate slots and make those saves often. Just choose memory on the menu. Be a man, or what have you. Action. It's important to try different things. If you have any doubts, check everything. Choices can easily cause deaths, so be careful. Sometimes you'll find hints in your friend's words. Don't just skim through the dialogue. Finally, perhaps my most useful advice, hold control to skip through messages. Hand if you're blasting through stuff you already read. It works well with holding the whole sifted ass thing. Guess that's it. Don't give in and forgive my metaness. The fuck? I just tell you to speak English and you give me a friggin' game guide? That's almost as ridiculous as a third grader being able to run this fast. I mean, holy crap. This is like flass on a crack. Jeez. Can I jump off this bed like I can do the one at home? Let me jump off of it. Let me jump off of it. Floor's weak. It'll be dangerous to jump off the bed. Granted, but are you gonna do it anyway? Screw it, no, I'm doing it. I'm doing it! Awesome. Wait, what? Did I die? Whatever. Well, that is episode one of Rekinder. I'm sure I'll play more later. I'll definitely play more later. This shit's righteous. But, I'll have to, one, make sure everything's awesomely hearable, because I told you I adjusted my microphone shit. And two, Oh, uh, I, I gotta, I, I gotta give bitch fuck money. You know how that shit works. So, yeah, see you later. Bye.